Good morning, folks. Today we're focused mostly on the sun, what's expected today, what happened yesterday, and the bullet we dodged as a planet. We'll also be checking in on Francine, the tropical storm in the Gulf of Mexico, but we are starting with the last 24 hours on our star. Once again, we had a few M-class solar flares. The most relevant one was a long-duration flare at the sunspot group just north of the equator near central longitudes. You see it sandwiched there between the large dark coronal holes. Let's take a closer look at that long-duration flare. You see it there erupting the plasma in the corona, and that visual combined with the long nature of the flare event we're not surprised to see a faint halo eruption. That should be on its way to Earth and arrive at the end of the week. We've already got faint CMEs on their way to Earth, expected today. Minor geomagnetic storm conditions likely and we'll have a coronal hole stream on the way from these, likely to arrive this weekend. Quick jump over to the infrared view of Tropical Storm Francine. It's expected to become a hurricane and then shoot north towards Louisiana for impact tomorrow. We've covered this one for a couple days in a row. Hopefully locals are ready for the event. We're back to the sun where in addition to yesterday's eruption and the ones expected to arrive at Earth today, yesterday morning we discussed a far side eruption which you can see around the periphery of the sun here rippling the corona in a massive way from just over the limb out of view on the far side of the sun. The CME became fully visible on satellite data yesterday and wow, I know we've got CMEs expected to arrive today and later this week, but what came off the far side was vastly bigger. Likely an X-class event? Good, that one is not heading our way. Should impact Venus today, actually. Folks, two big events coming up at Observer Ranch. First, in 10 days, the Founders Weekend events will take place. It's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Event tickets are listed in the link below. Go to ObserverRanch.com to book a stay at the campground. Also, October 19th, as many of you have already heard, the rest of the Observer Ranch team insists on bringing awareness to the fact that I'll be turning 40 years old. So, Founders Weekend in 10 days, my birthday event in about 5 weeks. Both event pages are listed below. Don't forget I'm out at the ranch every week, including today from late morning to early afternoon. We would love to see you out there. I hope you can come to one of the events or even for a quick visit some other time. Links below. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.